is going on guys i am at goodwill right now feeling good right feeling good will uh that's bad um anyway so i'm at goodwill and i am out just to find anything for a deal right so any uh vintage games any new games cds vhs game systems toys anything like that so last time i came here i stocked up on cds and some movies too i got like clone wars a couple of the seasons for like two bucks stupid good deals so let's go inside this goodwill and check it out all right looks like we got some imagine x action some battleship right there we got some of these nerf light guns nothing let's see what's in here if there's any figurage oh, there's a frogger game that's kind of cool don't know how much that guy is but that's cool that might be something what else is in here dolls cars got this tractor it's very interesting home decor let me check that out All right, trucks Gun right there. Another little truck right here. Cars and cars. There's a transformer with no head. Headmas Prime. And then I don't know. Let's look at this one over here. There's something. Tonka. There's a shoe. In here. Rescue Force ones. Nothing too crazy in there. Ooh, there's an Xbox break for $3.99. It's actually a pretty good deal. Nice. Something here. Let's see what we got. Trucks. That's all I ever find. I don't find any real, like, really super good toys that I good to get. Store shops, yes, but Goodwill, not so much. Thomas the Train. Yep. What's in here? Nada. Ooh, here's a figure. That's a, um, here's a war. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and get this guy. Then we got a PS3 controller for $3.99 and a Xbox 360 wireless for $4.99, but both of them seem better days. Super excited for a second because I was, I was like, I found a Marvel Legend. Or no, it's not even Marvel Legend. And he has no head. Poor Black Panther. And then I saw this Mega Bloks TMNT pack, but it's, uh, it's all open. So, that's a no-go. Could have been cool. This is actually something I probably would normally not pick up. But they have this Sesame Street 1977 Bert and Ernie cake pan. I think I'm gonna pick it up, guys. I mean, that is pretty sweet. I don't know how much it is, but $3.99, not too bad. All right guys, so I'm back from Goodwill and I got some pretty good pickups. Um, they didn't have any really good games or CDs that I saw, so I didn't even film that. But, pickup time, I got three things. So first, this was uh, the last thing you saw and I, for some reason I, I had to have it, but it's the 1977 Wilton Sesame Street uh, cake pan. So I got that for $3, not too bad, but it's a, uh, Bert and Ernie would have been sweet if it was if they had like Ninja Turtles or Motu, but they didn't. But this is still freaking cool for some reason. Had to have it, picked it up, and then I picked up this freaking tractor. This thing weighs like seven pounds, it feels like, but it's a Ertl um, McCormick Farm Mall tractor, but it's completely die cast. Uh, I got it for five bucks. I think I'm going to try to resell this. Uh, make a little 
a little change for my New York trip. Uh, this thing goes for like 30 to 35 bucks. So not bad at all. Super freaking clean. It's like straight out of the box. So I got that. The last but not least, got some action figure goodness. I got this, I believe it's Gears of War. So this is either going to be NECA or McFarlane. Um, but this is, uh, I don't know his name. So if you know this guy's name, comment down below, let me know. I, I might figure it out before then, but that would be appreciated. But his uh, jaw is articulated. Bam, burp, burp, burp. So anyway, got him. He was uh, two bucks, great deal. So anyway, on to the next hunt.